do you deal with a stubborn partner? Well, I suppose the very first part of the question is to make sure that first you're not the one who's stubborn and maybe you know you've gotten this this point where you've got two rams essentially you know and they just keep clashing heads and neither one wants to give up any ground and you're complaining that the other person is stubborn and so there's that possibility or maybe you haven't actually taken the time to honestly put yourselves yourself in their in their feet in mm-hmm. their perspective mm-hmm. you are not the one who's trying to understand where they're coming from and so the reason they appear to be stubborn is because they're not being heard now there is the other side of that coin they could just be stubborn on certain things you have to deal with me <laughs> i have to do you have to deal with me <laughs> you know i can be pretty stubborn on certain things i'm very loose and uh, loosey goosey on a lot of things but the handful of things i'm stubborn on uh, i'm stubborn on you know that's kind of the personality quirks the parts of people that you accept when you decide to love you're, somebody you're you're allowed to have that and so am i yeah and if you don't want to give that to the other person well then do you, you expect the other person to give it to you? I mean, you can't expect different behaviors. You have to have some consistency. Now, nothing's ever eternally equal, but within a general scope of things, are you expecting similar behavior that you're giving? Are you giving similar behavior from what you're expecting? And maybe the answer to the question is are they being stubborn is are we being stubborn have we both dug our heels in and we're just talking in circles and so we're being stubborn rather than say okay whatever discussion we're having we're both just sitting here talking in circles we're no longer listening to each other we're talking past each other we're more interested in winning the conversation than it is in trying to figure out what's really going on and how do we find some way to move forward and maintain peace because maybe the real answer to the question is what's the goal mm-hmm. is the goal to win or is the goal to have a productive um, fulfilling long-term relationship sometimes the answer to that second part is taking a step back and maybe changing the conversation you're having and maybe you're just having the wrong conversation maybe what you're actually arguing about isn't what you're actually arguing about which is why you never get anything resolved yeah a little bit of love a little bit of understanding a little bit of genuinely trying to understand the other person's perspective goes a long way and that is your daily dose of love